Well, for the past several months, we've been asking our viewers at home to tell us what they are doing to make our neighborhoods a little greener as part of our Eye on the Environment contest. We've selected three finalists and we'll introduce you to a new one each week all month long. For our second contestant, we head to New Rochelle High School. Through presentations, workshops, and educational films, New Rochelle created an entire day's worth of activities to show how they were going green. It just kind of, um, kind of like hit home so you know like what you're doing and how you need to change it. Sustainability Day at New Rochelle High School has been a year in the making. From interactive workshops to art projects of all kinds and even an on-campus vegetable garden, students and teachers alike put their best foot forward when it comes to protecting our planet. There are multiple facets to the problem of why we are in the situation that we're in and so to start these students with looking at the problems but from an angle of why this happened historically, why these decisions were made, and where the opportunities are to turn it around, it doesn't seem so overbearing, it doesn't seem like a crushing responsibility that they really do have to face. So the kids put their heads together and started making changes. Instead of buying maple syrup in a grocery store, they learned how to make their own in an eco-friendly way. You make a 7 16 hole about two inches into the tree, and then you would put this spile, which we just call a tap, right into the tree. And if the temperatures are right, you'll immediately see sap dripping out of the tree right when you take the drill bit out. Graphic design students developed unique ad campaigns to demonstrate the harmful effects of plastic bottle pollution. Other kids expressed their passion for bettering the earth in an artistic way using only recyclable materials. And some seniors made it their mission to teach younger children about simple ways they can help too. I thought it was really important to work with young kids because uh, they really need to start learning this kind of a concept early because then they can just build on it and they can learn things that are easy to do like turning off the light or taking a smaller shower. and. Uh, carpooling with a friend. At New Rochelle High School, going green is a part of school every day. The students started by improving their own habits and then spread the word to their families and their school. But their ultimate goal is to change the world. Obviously, we need to sustain Sustainability Day. There, there's no question. Um, it wasn't meant to be a one-shot day that was going to cure everything. And that's one of the reasons why having the sustainability major is important um, so that these children can be the future. And next month, we're going to open up our contest to you at home and let you pick the winner of our $5,000 grand prize. Voting begins on May 5th after Richard French Live, and all you have to do is log on to our website at rnntv.com to cast your vote. The winner will be announced on May 12th, so make sure you log on and vote for your favorite finalist.